Today, I'm going to go by key things the Holy Spirit does in the life of a Christian. The Holy Spirit plays a vital role in the life of every child of God. The life of faith is not possible without the ministry of the Holy Spirit. But you must be aware of His role in your life so you can yield to Him every day and receive His help. In John chapter 14, verse 26, Jesus said, But the Comforter, the Counselor, Helper, Intercessor, Advocate, Strengthener, Standby, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, in my place, to represent me and act on my behalf. He will teach you all things, and He will cause you to recall, will remind you of, and bring to your remembrance everything I have told you. You see, in this key, important Bible verse, Jesus highlights key things the Holy Spirit does in the life of a child of God. The Holy Spirit is a counselor, helper, intercessor, advocate, strengthener, and standby. It is impossible to fail when you yield and depend on the help of the Holy Spirit. With the help of the Holy Spirit, as a child of God, you should never feel alone. He's there to be with you. As a child of God, you should never feel lost. He's there to guide you. As a child of God, you should never feel defeated because you have the power from the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit plays a vital role to help ensure you always win and you always live in victory. Now I'm going to go into the key highlight of the role the Holy Spirit plays in your life every day to help you live victoriously as a child of God. The very first important thing I want to talk about the Bible says that the Holy Spirit is your advocate. The Holy Spirit is your advocate. Why is it important to know this? Who's an advocate? An advocate is a lawyer, the one who defends you, who always has your back. And the Holy Spirit as your advocate. You have to really understand exactly what that means. Who's an advocate? An advocate is a person who represents another person. An advocate is a person who is on your side. The Bible says the Holy Spirit is your advocate. The Bible says, if God be for you, who can be against you? And can you imagine knowing that the Holy Spirit is your advocate, your chief lawyer, your lawyer, always on your side, on your side. The one who is standing on your side with you always is the Holy Spirit. The Bible lets you know that this advocate is the Holy Spirit. The second important thing I want to talk about who the Holy Spirit is, the Holy Spirit is your comforter, your comforter. Who's a comforter? Look, your comforter is there when you go through tough times to reassure you that everything is going to be okay. And I want you to understand what it means to have the Holy Spirit as your comforter. The Bible says the Holy Spirit is your comforter. The Comforter reassures you at moments when you need to be encouraged. A Comforter tells you it's going to be okay. A Comforter is there at those difficult and challenging times. The Comforter is there to reassure you and tell you everything is going to be okay. In the toughest and the most difficult times, the Holy Spirit is your Comforter. He reassures you and encourages you at the most difficult times. The Holy Spirit is always with you. And one of the things the Holy Spirit is, He's your Comforter. And in the most difficult times, you are never alone. You have the Comforter, the Holy Spirit, who encourages you, reassures you, and He reminds you that everything is going to be okay. He actually remind you that everything is okay and everything will remain okay and in the times of difficulties the holy spirit as your comforter will remind you of scriptures the bible verses that you have stored in your heart he will bring them to your memory he will remind you of who you are as a child of god and the holy spirit as your comforter will tell you he will say child of god remember you are the head not the tail above and never below the holy spirit as your comforter will tell you remember the bible says all things will always work together for your good. He will remind you of scripture. He will comfort you with the word of God. On the most difficult times, the most challenging times, you can always depend on the Holy Spirit 
as your comforter. The third important thing I want to talk about who the Holy Spirit is, the Bible says the Holy Spirit is your standby. Who's a standby? A standby is always there when you need him. At any point of your life, you are never alone. The Holy Spirit is your standby. He's always there to help you and you are never alone. Your Holy Spirit is your standby. And the Holy Spirit as your standby, I want you to understand exactly what it means to have the Holy Spirit as your standby. A standby is always there, always there and available. It's always there to help you address everything that is necessary. The Bible tells you about, the, the Bible tells you that God said in his word, he will never leave you, he will never forsake you. And the Holy Spirit, as you stand by, he's always there, he's always available, always there to help you doing those things that are necessary. Who's a standby? A standby is always there for everything that is needed. A standby is always there to make sure everything that you that that you need as you know you have it the holy spirit as you stand by is always available and never leaves you and the fourth important thing the holy spirit is to you your, the holy spirit is your intercessor he helps you in the place of prayer it's important that you understand that the holy spirit helps you in the place of prayer he helps you pray accurately he also helps you pray according to the will of god for your life now i want you to understand who the holy spirit is as your intercessor the bible says the holy spirit is your intercessor in the place of prayer he helps you pray who's an intercessor an intercessor is one who intervenes on your behalf in the place of prayer the bible says that you know not to, you know not to pray as you ought to pray. The Holy Spirit helps you pray accurately the will of God. As your intercessor is your helper in the place of prayer. It helps you pray accurately the will of God. You, you have to understand how do you yield and receive help from the Holy Spirit in the place of prayer. You are, remember the Holy Spirit is God. And in the place of prayer, you have to understand that you have the all-knowing God helping you in the place of prayer. And when he prays, and when he helps you pray, he helps you pray accurately the will of God. And the fifth important thing the Holy Spirit is to you, the Holy Spirit is to you as a Christian, your stronghold. The Holy Spirit is to you, your stronghold. And you have to understand the Holy Spirit's role in your life as your stronghold. And what's a stronghold? A stronghold speaks of strength a place that's fortified and a stronghold. I want, I want you to visualize what a stronghold symbolizes. A stronghold symbolizes a place that has been fortified. It, it is, it's a place that's fortified against any kind of attack. A, a stronghold speaks of protection against any attack. Who's a stronghold? A stronghold is a fortified place of protection against all attacks. The Holy Spirit is your stronghold. The Holy Spirit is your fortified protection always. And absolutely nothing can come against you successfully because you have the protection of the Holy Spirit. Your Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit is your stronghold. He, your, he's always there, always with you. You're always safe because you have the Holy Ghost living on the inside of you. And the sixth thing the Holy Spirit is to you as a Christian, the Holy Spirit is your counselor. Who is your counselor? Your counselor advises you and gives you wise counsel. And the Holy Spirit as your counselor. I want you to understand who the Holy Spirit is as your counselor. Who's a counselor? A counselor gives you counsel and guidance. You know why? A counselor that advises you is because a counselor always has specialized knowledge. I want you to understand you have the all-wise God, the Holy Spirit living on the inside of you as your counselor, always guiding you and leading you accurately and perfectly. The Holy Spirit as your counselor always guides you accurately, giving you the wise counsel. Anytime anyone is a counselor, they are counselors because they have 
knowledge. The Holy Spirit has specialized knowledge. He is God. He is the all-wise God. And the Bible says the Holy Spirit is your counsel. And I, want you to, and I really want you to understand the Holy Spirit is everything you could ever imagine then much more. So I encourage you to lean in and depend on the help of the Holy Spirit. He is so many things to you and everything you could ever imagine. He is your advocate. He is your standby. He is your intercessor. He is your stronghold. He is your comforter. He is your counselor. At all times, you have everything you need then much more. You are never alone. You are never lost. And you'll always win with the Holy Spirit. And I encourage you to lean into the Holy Spirit. He's everything you need him to be. And then much more. The Holy Spirit is God. And he's God living on the inside of you. It's important that you treasure and appreciate everything the Holy Spirit does in your life as a Christian. I hope what I've shared today has shed some light on who the Holy Spirit is and the important things he does in the life of every Christian. I want to say thank you for tuning in with me for another awesome episode of my program. Join me next week for another awesome episode of Beyond Any Limit. Good night, everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe to this channel.